Welcome to Frontenac Outfitters Canoe and Kayak Centre. This is a kayak video review of Wilderness Systems Tempest 165. It's part of the three boat series that also includes the Tempest 170 and the much larger 180. The two smaller boats, the 170 and the 165 you see here, are also available in their Pro series, which means composite, and of course composite means fiberglass. But let's deal with this guy. At 16.6 in length, it has a relatively narrow 21 and a half inch beam and a shallow deck height of 10 and 3 quarter inches. So it's really designed to fit smaller paddlers well in that 95, 99 to about 155 pound range, obviously depending how you carry your weight and your paddling skills or lack thereof. At a glance, this build quality is very, very good. Again, Gen 2 polyethylene. All the fittings are very well done and are done to expedition quality. That means there's lots of robust deck rigging in the right places. We have perimeter safety rescue lines that help get you in or out or help your friend get back into their boat. This is for your, your compass. We have tamper proof locking points, both bow and stern and easy grip handles. The boat comes with three in-house hatches, a bow, a stern, and a day hatch, and also has three foam bulkheads, one here, one here, and one here. And of course those bulkheads provide dry storage, they also add buoyancy to your craft as well. Seat system, sea kayaks have a smaller cockpit to really create that one of feeling and Wildy uh, arguably does the best seat system in the world. This is called a Phase 3 Air Pro XP and that includes an ergonomic back bend nice and low so it does not inhibit torso turn, low angle efficient paddle stroke. We have hip pads that we can adjust in or out to create a better fit this way. We have thigh braces that can get moved forward or aft or in or out. And my favorite feature is we have a seat pan, the front of which pulls up underneath that paddler to really get that one of fit and to take stress off your legs. The boat design itself is fish form. Fish form means it has a slightly uh, wider bow. Widest point is just front of center. The chine of the boat. The chine of the boat is what we call a soft chine. So soft chine is round, but it does tend to contain a flat wall in the center section. What that does is help provide very good initial and secondary stability. Initial stability is achieved with a shallow V hull and a long waterline length. Secondary stability is for edging, learning skills, that type of thing, developing your skills, as the boat will tend to come over and sit on that flat wall. So very, very well done. It has a skeg control. A skeg control is located on the starboard side, and that will allow you to move your skeg control forward or back, or up or down, anywhere in between. Again, ideally suited, suited for small paddlers who may just want to go out for a, might go out for an hour, but they want to be efficient and they might just get turned on the paddling. So this allows them to do that in an economical way. And if they do get turned on paddling and want to improve their skills, it's a very good boat for skills progression. We're Frontenac Outfitters Canoe and Kayak Center. We've been e introducing people to paddle sports since 1984, we do it the right way, in conjunction with Mother Nature. Come on out and paddle with us. We'd love to see you. Thank you.